is Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting dream to episode 14 of Delicious Party Pretty Cures. It's gotten to get started in three, two, hold on, in three, two, one, go. There we go. Okay, let's freaking help today. My son get a transformation scene. I mean, it is now the 12th. It is currently now Sunday for me and such. I, I would have watched this today, but bad news came and if you follow me on Twitter seen the things that I retweeted yeah Wait, it's a confession. so happy I'm watching this first because I like I said I mean you know when I watched episode 13 I was like I need to kind of straight up watch this like ASAP because okay I came home from work I got home like between one between one and one thirty and I went to go get myself something to eat I ate and I fell asleep and I feel like I'm getting sick because my mom is currently sick, she's got a summer cold, and I feel like I'm getting her summer cold at the same time, which sucks. So, I was like, I need to go to sleep. Plus, the fact is, I didn't go to bed till like, really, really late last night, or Friday night, going on Saturday morning, and such. So, I was like, okay, um, yeah, I need to go to sleep. Then, the bad news that really is saddening over the whole anime community as a whole and literally crying and reminiscing about certain things about this person and then finally recording this but still we we better see a transformation scene i need that for today i'm just saying you cannot screw me over with no transformation scene please and thank you give me that mother effing transformation scene for my son that's all i freaking want See, of course he's going to say no because he loves Yui. Oh, this is so cute. Mm -hmm. Oh, Larry. See, if, if if Mary wasn't one of the girls, I think everybody would be falling for him, including myself. Come on now. <laughs>
It's good, though. Yeah, and he enjoys it. Mm-hmm. I know, we're really more or less talking about love here. Oh, tell more. You're right. Yeah, but at least she's going to find out that he likes Yui. Mary is so precious. Once again, I need a whole episode on Mary and Mary only. Like, oh, give it. Once again, not the greatest. <laughs> I can't. I'm sorry. Cause this, <laughs> once Gentle started, I was like, that's it. Best thing. Best boon to do. And then after that, like, now. Nope. <laughs> oh. Uh-huh. about Yui. <laughs> well, talk to me. It's very obvious, baby. Plus, it was cute. They were all just walking, and it has happened, you know. Yeah, you know, Yui, she's a bubbly airhead that we love so freaking much. Don't be mean. Hmm. 
Excuse me. Maybe she'll come out next week. I mean, you know, once again, I know we're getting closer to for, you know, Cure Finale to make an appearance, but... We just pushing that. We stretching this. Mm -mm. Like, I understand that we have to stretch this out, but at the same time, I'm over here like, do we really need to? Like, for the story, is it really necessary? Because, I mean, they did that with Laura. And I think that's why a lot of people are, like, a hit or a miss with her. But come on now. <laughs> of course, <laughs> she had some spice. Yeah, since you guys are pretty here, you guys are automatically fine. Is that one of those toaster presser things? It is! <laughs> I, I kind of wanted one of those. I, because, like, people make really good, like, breakfast sandwiches or whatever, and I'm like, damn, that looks yummy.
Of course. Seriously? Okay, thank God. Mm -hmm. I like the name, though. Oh, he's so freaking cute! <laughs> And then we got some black peppers immediately gone, right? Of course! Hook fighter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't reciprocate your feelings. No. Unfortunately. Oh,
Okay, so one, I love the fact that Takumi is using Black Pepper as his name, but, because it's going to be obvious when Yui figures it out, because of course, like, I feel like we're going to, they're, they're going to, okay, just like with Cure Finale, of course, they're, they're going to stretch this out. You know, we might get it as, you know, because technically, you know, Black Pepper is our freaking tuxedo mask of this series. Until we find out who he is. But then, okay, so would Cinnamon be Takumi's dad, of course? Because it has to be. Because he also had a delicious stone, which now Takumi has. And he's using as black pepper, which I'm guessing, excuse me, Takumi's dad was using it as Cinnamon. Which now also means, maybe, because I did see something earlier, and maybe, um, like a couple of hours ago on Twitter... And it could be the thing in the preview for this next episode that possibly indicating that Takumi's dad and Mary used to be an item, possibly? I don't know, because see, once again, we still don't know that much about Mary, and I want to know about his past. I mean, yes, they could go a little more in-depth on his love relationship with other people and such, and if he ever truly was in love, because he seems like the type of guys or girls gal who was in love with someone and unfortunately you know due to a circumstances yeah him and his lover boyfriend whoever no longer together and you want to know why i want to be a fly on that wall i'm just saying toy <laughs> Can we just talk about how Kokone is very much similar to uh, Komi-san from uh, Komi Can't Communicate? Even though, like, okay, here's the big difference. Kokome can't, can communicate. Komi can't. Uh, they're both shy. You can see that. There is some dim similarities with them in certain things. But, I mean, like, still... Baby about to have her first picnic next week. She about to go on a lunch date with her girlfriends and her classmates. But really more of her girlfriends. Her girlfriends. And that's going to be sweet. Like, honestly, I'm really ready for that. I felt like that the background that they used for that, showing all three of them together, kind of gave me, like, a little reminiscence to the sound of music, you know. Um... I think it's Julie, Julie, Julie Andrews, Julie Andrews, I believe, where she's like up in the, up in the, the grass, like this big field of grass, and there's like a mountain in the background, and she starts he's singing like the hills are alive and such. I've ne I've seen only that part of the movie. My mom says I've seen the whole movie, and I'm like, I barely remember that ish. Like, what's, <laughs> I don't remember certain things. I just know of that scene because that movie is always freaking iconic because of that scene. But yeah, it does make you wonder, when is Takami going to tell Yui about the fact that he knows that Yui is a pretty cure? And when is Yui going to find out that Takami is Black Pepper? So I, I'm going to give it till episode 30. That's my guess. Because they're going to they're gonna run this. And I can, I think I'll even stay to the end of the freaking series. So either by episode 30 or by episode 49. 49 episode, like from now to 49 is really stretching it. But if they do it by episode 30, then yeah, because then I would like to see these two, you know, fight together, which we're pretty much going to see. But I do want to see as romantic moments with these two. Plus, I want to see Takumi finally confess to Yui because once again, it is obvious that he has a crush on Yui. It's just, it's... It's his, it's, oh my god. The the stage is his. He's going to be the one to confess to her. It's not going to be Yui confessing to him. As much as I would love to see that, but the stage is already set. He's probably going to be the one to do it. We just have to stay here and wait, unfortunately. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 14 of Delicious Party Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 15. Bye, guys.